What's up everybody? It's the one, the only Derek Colors helping you get a bad body. Okay guys, so today I'm gonna show you the exercises that we're gonna do today when we go to the gym. Um, and, and guess what? I'm actually going to an apartment gym. So for all you guys who cannot get to a local gym, there's no excuse. You live in an apartment, you don't need a lot of equipment when you work in shoulders. And that's what we're working today. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to build all three uh, heads of your delt, okay? Now remember, for some of you guys who may not know, you got your front delt, you got your side delt, and your rear delt. You have to work all three heads of that delt in order for you to have that round, bolder shoulder look. You know, and I know a lot of ladies don't wanna look big, but this is the thing that I had to explain to a lot of ladies. They are afraid to lift weights. They're afraid that if they do too much lifting, they're going to get all bulky. Well, I'm going to tell you, ladies, it's not that easy to get bulky, okay? If it was, everybody would be bulky, especially guys. If it only took a week, two weeks, a month of hard work on the shoulders or hard work on your body to get bulky, Everybody will be doing that who are looking for that bulk. So I'm gonna tell you what you do is you do you work those muscles, you work them, you do you tone them. See, you don't want to be loose and soft, you want to tone. So the first stage of building muscle is toning. You can you're gonna your muscles are gonna start getting tighter, a little more developed. Once you get it to where you want it to be then you don't go heavy anymore. You stick at a lower weight and do more reps. That's how you tone your muscles and keep them toned over the years without bulking and getting big because you're not using heavy, heavy weight. You start out using some heavy weight, get your body to where you want to look, and then you decrease the weight, then you start doing more reps, and that's how you tone. So don't be afraid, ladies, to go to the gym and hit your upper body. I know a lot of ladies are focusing on their lower bodies, and guess what? I have something for you. I am now officially training women for glutes, and a lot of women are asking me for it. Uh, they see the women that's in my life, my daughters, my girlfriend, they see how they're built. And what I'm doing is I'm helping them build. So, you know, I have a lot of ladies who want to start doing glute exercises with me. So if you're looking to build your glutes, then guess what? Hit your boy up, leave a message, Instagram me, DM me, whatever you have to do, and I'll get back to you. So if you're looking for those glutes, let's go make it happen. Make sure you like share and subscribe to the channel okay it really helps me out and one other thing i would ask you is leave a comment because you know sometimes i'm over critical with my videos so i'm thinking it's not good until i hear people tell me that they loved it so leave a comment that kind of helps boost my confidence and makes me know that i'm doing the right thing and that i can just keep on shooting out these videos to you okay all right enough talking let's get to this workout all right so the first exercise we'll start with is plate raises. What I'm doing on these plate raises is I'm putting a little more emphasis on the delts by turning. Now you don't have to do this with your plate raises, but for me, it allows me to work those front delts longer. I really wanna put more emphasis on my front delts. So for you advanced guys, this will be good for you, okay? If you know, Delts are hard for me to build in the first place. So for me, I just really want to put more emphasis on my delts. And so we're working the front delts again. Now notice, I'm not swinging the weight. I'm not using my lower back. I'm keeping my core tight. And I'm also raising the dumbbells slightly higher than parallel. Again, everything is about putting emphasis on letting that muscle work longer than normal. Time on attention is really gonna help build your muscles. So we finished up with that. So then we went to the side delts. Now again, notice, everything is about being under control. I'm not slinging the, the dumbbells up and down. I'm controlling them up, slightly higher than parallel, and I'm controlling it down. I'm not dropping it down quickly because if I do drop it quicker, it's not going to put as much emphasis on the muscle. So again, time on attention. 
So I'm working the same muscle, but this time I'm going behind my back. So this is behind the back side raises, dumbbell raises. And with this, the reason why I did this is because I just want to put a little more emphasis on making sure the side delts are working by starting with the dumbbells behind my back, not the front. You know, sometimes when you do side raises, if you do them, it's gonna work your front delts some too. And I just wanted to make sure that I hit those side delts uh, by starting with the motion from the back. Okay, so here we go. We're doing bent over rear dumbbell raises. And on this, now notice the dumbbells are coming slightly forward. Because I just wanna put, again, emphasis on the muscles that I'm using. And since I'm not working lats, I'm working rear delts. I wanna make sure that I come a little slightly forward to put it more on my upper back where my delts are. Now this exercise is the king of having a big shoulder. Shoulder press. You can do the dumbbell shoulder press or you can do the barbell shoulder press. Either one, but if this do if you do these exercises, this is working all three heads of the shoulders, which is gonna give you that real defined look from the front side and rear. Getting stronger in this exercise is really gonna help you when you do the other exercises dealing with the shoulders, but make sure that this is something that you put a lot of emphasis on. Now we're gonna focus on the traps. So what I'm doing is dumbbell upright row. Again, let's go put some heavy weight with it. If you're doing lightweight on these traps, it's not gonna work. So what we're doing is, notice I'm coming down under control and I'm coming up to the chin, not necessarily above it, okay? So now we're gonna end with the same shoulder work, uh, muscle to work. We're working the trap. So this is barbell shoulder shrugs. And notice, I'm controlling it up and down, up and down. I'm not slinging it, I'm not bending, I'm not wild with it. And the Smith machine helps you stay under control also because it doesn't allow you to swing as much. So if you have an uh, issue with trying to do this with the regular bar, use the Smith machine, all right? All right, so we are getting inventory done to get ready for a big sale these are some of the clothes that we're gonna take to my print guy at zippies these are some of the items that we already have that we're going to sell get ready guys got a lot of nice bad body clothes there's some of the ladies got Women tees, V-neck tees, women tank tops, baseball shirts, uh, jackets, leggings, shorts, joggers for men, hoodies. Yep, bad bodies is on its way. So again, we're gonna get this out this week. We're gonna set a lunch date. Tell me what you think about these baseball tees. Once I get them. I'll show you what they look like. I love them. Actually, to tell you the truth, I actually have a baseball tee on. And they actually, I love them. People are asking about them. So we're going to get these out to you guys as soon as we get everything up and ready. Get, get this thing organized and structured.